Hey, hey everyone, Angela O'Hare here, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. And of course, I have my sidekick, Damien. Damien with me, and we're over here at Lark Hill, a brand new single family attached home community, is what they're trying to call it. Yeah. To me, I consider this a townhome community. Over here in the Kessel Commons Village, this community just opened up this weekend, and they have three different floor plans to choose from. And the nice feature is all the floor plans will have a balcony, which is pretty cool. And um, they're all two-story. And the base price of this one, Unit 2, which will always be an end unit, is $514,900. That's just the base price and does not include your lot premium, structural options, or upgrades. There are a total of 105 home sites. And this is not a gated community. And there's gonna be two different HOAs. You're gonna have Lark Hill HOA of 199 and Summerlin West HOA of 60, so a total of 259. This is actually a great floor plan. It's nice and big and open. Seems like the kitchens are on all of them on the same side. They went with a nice luxury vinyl plank flooring, wide plank, very nice, right? Don't you think? I like it, yeah. Then they also have the same white shaker cabinets, the nice large island with the quartz countertops. And they did the farmhouse sink here, which is nice. I like the farmhouse sink. And that's usually gonna be an upgraded feature to have. Um, this was the one we liked best last time, I think. Yeah. I like this right here where you can make it your coffee bar, right? That would be kind of cool. I'd use that. Yeah. And I like how all of these have the nice pantries. Let's see if they went with the... Nope, they didn't do any of the soft closed yeah. cabinets. And they also have a half bath downstairs. This is the only one that they really did some upgrades to. Typically they'll come with the pedestal sink and the toilet. There's a closet here as well. And then the garage, which we don't have access to. Um, so what they do have is six specked out homes, meaning all options have already been selected. And they do have a couple where you can select the structural options. Sometimes, typically in a townhome community like this, they try to spec out all the homes because it's easier because they have the three units to build. So it's easier to get everything specked out first. Um, and then build it um, and so usually I think I find it that they pick a lot of nice options what you'll find is normally they're going to make sure that all of downstairs has the hard surface flooring and the upstairs has the carpeting um, let's see have we gone over everything else yeah and the SIDS are $222.33 semi-annually okay let's go upstairs they went with the light colored carpeting in here. I keep on thinking this is Woodside Homes, but it's Taylor Morrison. So this is cute too. When you walk up, you have a nice loft. And then you have the primary that way. And then the two bedrooms over here. Hall closet. Smaller laundry room, but for me, I don't care if I have a big laundry room. They have the upgraded cabinets. No sink in this one. I don't know. Everyone loves having their sinks in their laundry room. Oh, yeah. This one has the Jack and Jill, which is nice. If you have kids, this has the nice Jack and Jill. The double vanity with the quartz countertops and the white shaker cabinets. They did the same luxury vinyl flooring. And then they went with the builder grade tub shower combo, which like I've said in all my videos, especially for a kid's bathroom, it's just worth getting the generic tub shower. Then I'm gonna walk in through the other side so we can see what the other bedroom looks like. But the cool thing is, is that you can close this door while the other kid is in here. And you can still close this door as well. You can close all the doors if you want to take up the whole bathroom. <laughs> I 
I mean, it feels like a 12 by 12 room. Okay. Now we're going to go take a look at the primary. I like houses with lofts. It's always a great feature to have. It makes the house feel bigger. It doesn't feel closed in. This is a decent sized primary bedroom. All of this has that extra recessed lighting, which is an upgrade usually. The primary and the great room are the only rooms that will be pre-wired for a ceiling fan. And another nice feature is this one also has the beautiful balcony off of the primary suite. It's a nice size balcony and you have the beautiful mountain views. Over there is Viero, I do believe. That's Ravencrest by Toll Brothers and that's Quell Cove by KB Homes. They did a nice job with this shower. The same flooring. It looks like all these bathrooms look the same in all of these floor plans, but they did some upgraded touches in the shower. And they did the generic pan insert though. And they have the nice double vanity with the white um, shaker cabinets and the white quartz cabinets, which I do believe comes with this as a normal item that comes with the house. Now this is a decent bigger closet than the rest and I like the shelves that they have and then the smart panel. So to summarize we're over here at Lark Hill by Taylor Morrison a brand new community that just opened up in the Kestrel Commons Village. We're taking a tour of the plan or unit two which is 1796 square feet, three bedrooms, two and a half baths, and a two-car garage base price starting at five hundred and fourteen thousand nine hundred that's just the base price that does not include lot premium structural options or any upgrades if you are thinking about buying in this community or anywhere in las vegas i am your new home sales expert i sell a lot of new construction you can always call me at 702-370-5112 Thank you guys so much for watching. Let us know in the comments what you think of this floor plan. And most importantly, show us some love and hit that like and subscribe button. See you guys on the next one.